our attendance is in the top three or four in the NBA G League. And they're not going to beat Mexico City's numbers, but everybody <laughs> else's. Iowa's done a really nice job of getting the fans to support this team. Backs it out a little. Now looks to drive it, picks up the dribble. Now Cook, nice drive by Devontae Cook down the middle of the lane and a right-hand flush. On the replay by David Duke Jr., but then Javante Cook returning the favor. He has just a, one of those grins on his face like, man, they're there. They just ain't falling. Jason Nix picks the pocket of... Oh, beautiful finish there. <laughs> a little hesitation in the air. And a nice save again, and this time inside for Martin. Tyrese Martin with a finish and a foul. He'll go to the line for the three-point play. So Iowa basketball, they'll have it baseline right here. Trevor Keels will inbound. Lob inside, Dacian Nix on a little alley-oop lob. And Austin settling for threes and not hitting it. And Iowa's built a 10-point lead. Oh, beautiful drive by Duke to collapse the defense. Three up and good by Sissoko. You could tell that was off when he left his hand. A little strong, <laughs> yeah. Here's Gray, pulls up baseline. Nice, smooth floater on the baseline there by Gray. Top of the key for Iowa. And Smith. Oh, Smith with a two-hand flush. Perfectly executed pick and roll that time between Javante Cook and Chris Smith. Keels around the screen. Keels floats one up, no good. Vili oh, he circles walked. out and he got away with a step. And oh, Javante Cook surprised everyone with a two-hand flush. Boy. And into the hands of Barlow. Now Bouye looks to drive it. Bouye into the paint, gives it off to Barlow, and Barlow flushes it through. Barlow's woke up here in the second quarter to help the Spurs stay close. He has 10 now in the ball game, 115 here in Iowa. As both teams at it tonight, and we'll be back at it for the final game of the regular season tomorrow. Now Dolovich with the bucket in the paint. Good pass for Bishanish Vili, who has it blocked from behind by Watson. Now the lob up top, oh! look out. Sissoko <laughs> flushes one through. Doubled off the ball screen. Now Duke will try the three, and he knocks it down. 13 for Duke. He started fast. He's trying to finish fast now here in the first half. Now David Duke Jr. Circles. Duke had a fast start and then kind of slowed down and then finished strong, and there he goes, a fast start from the third. Jamari Bouye puts it on the wow. floor. Left hand shot off the mark. Nice Up ahead, lead. it's Tyrese Martin, and Martin with a two-hand flush. 15 now for Martin, and Iowa back to within two. They are definitely letting that happen. Good contest there, but that three off the mark, Bouye gets the offensive rebound. And a nice drive and a little punch with the left hand. Knicks tried to steal from behind. For the final game of the season for Iowa Wolves basketball, and again, thank you to all the fans who supported Iowa and all of the NBA G League teams this season. Trevor Keels knocks down a three on the right wing. Omari Hardy wide open in the corner. Three is off the mark, no good. Good outlet pass, David Duke Jr. Fouled and count the basket. Strong move there. Abdalovich came in and took it away. Now the nice oh, split there wow. and David Duke Jr. Bouye done a lot. But oh, Betty Ako gets his own rebound. Three seconds. Hardy stops. Three on the way. Got it to go off the window. They'll take a look at it, but I think that clearly counts. Here we go. Well, Sasoko didn't even know the ball was coming to him. He had his back turned and went off his leg. Back for Stevenson. Three on the way. Yeah. Three is good. Boy, all of a sudden, what have we got here, John? Go after him, but boy, just nice put back there. All right, we're going to catch their breath here a little bit. Now Hardy oh, into nice. the paint. What a pretty move there by Amari Hardy with the left-hand Euro step. Hardy will try the three. That's off the side of the iron, no good. Austin trying to add to the six-point lead. Cook, oh, wow. Or check that. Duke right down Main Street for the flush. Lead back to single digits, 103-95. There's McCoy. Tough shot, gets it to go. Four out for McCoy. He's, sick. He's eight for 18 overall, but 0 for six from three. And a run out here away. for Austin. And the flush with two hands by Javante McCoy. 
shot to go. Next is a six of 20 from the field. And McCoy up through contact finishes. McCoy's come up big here. And two points. Now he's already up to 11 off the bench on this run by the Spurs. And Javante Cook from deep. JC coming up big again. A oh, good ball movement. Now the drive and Bouye shot no good and the dunk followed off the mark. And that leads to a fast break the other way. Dacian Nix hammers one on the other end. It's a six point lead Nix for Austin. David Duke Jr. hesitates now, elevates, shot is up and good off the front of the rim. 32 points and timeout called. And a timeout called. The lead is eight. Really sank there in that late second quarter into the third quarter. Nix for three, he knocks it down. Big three there by Dacian Nix. Gets it back, trying to find a three ball. Left wing three, no good. Martin, Martin with the rebound. rebound. Dacian Nix left open for three, got it. Wow. And they're gonna have to foul here. It. Trying to find Tyrese Martin off a screen. Martin catches near midcourt. Martin's gonna drive it and flush it through. 5.3 seconds. Trying to get it in, Cook catches, fires a three. Nope, that'll end it. No good, and the rebound, the last rebound of the ball game for Raekwon Gray. And that's the final buzzer here at the Wells Fargo Arena.